So these are in stock already too. 5XL Stiletto is in stock and 5XL Square is also back in stock. I'm trying to remember, was I live Saturday? I was. So here we will compare our XXL phalanges. So let's take a quick little gander on top of this. this box is Dior and it looks like crocodile skin kind of, doesn't it? So here we have 5XL Stiletto, which is what I'm wearing right now. This is XXL Stiletto, the regular one, the OG of OGs. This is XXL Sculpted Stiletto, which is a new shape that's not out yet. It's ready, but we're not launching it. We're launching it at the same time that we're launching the um, Flash Shell uh, restock. And this is Extreme Tapered Stiletto, which is the most sculpted looking in regards to like it being really skinny and pointy. So let's get a quick close-up of all of the long phalanges. Mm, there you guys, so fab, obsessed. Which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. I think my personal favorites are, oh gosh, I love all of them. But I mean, you can't go wrong with long phalanges. Look at that. This design is so sick. It's very geometric, very abstract, giving me a little bit of Versace vibes. Gold chains, everything. Lena, is uh, Mr. Roundface in there? Where'd he go? Disappeared. So we're going to take a size zero, 5XL. Beautiful. Let's shape it to the cuticle area. Make sure it fits perfectly. Stunning, stunning. Then we're gonna get some DIY gel. I feel like your movements with long phalanges are just like more eye-catching, if you will, and just so glamorous. So make sure we apply enough DIY gel to the inside of the one, two, three, go because the phalange is longer and the 5XL do have a higher apex and a deeper C curve, so you need to fill in that gap. So what I recommend if you're gonna wear these is to apply some press-on gel on your free edge just to build it out. And that way it's higher, so that way when we put the nail on, that um, press-on gel on your free edge will help Fill in the gap. Let's freeze her for a few seconds. Take it for one minute inside the dazzling dome. Well, that really wow. Oh my gosh, it's prehistoric. That's when it started, but uh, but we should have record of sending the repo though. When we send her 16. Mm -hmm. Very very old. So much work here at EnoCouture.com, you guys. Never a dull moment. No rest for the wicked. But I'm just living for the 5XLs. You guys have been um, so warm and welcoming them to the enocouture.com123go line. 
and I'm just so overwhelmed with happiness and joy that you guys love the longest nails in the game, you guys. We have retaken the title. And I think it's because we make we put so much love in everything that we manufacture and everything that we do. And I think it really shows in our product, and I think that's what makes our brand different from everybody else, is the attention to detail, not only in the packaging, but also in our incredible customer service, in our education, in our packaging, everything. It's just done with so much love, you know what I mean? Can you feel the love? Let me know. Press number four if you can feel the love too. So now let's begin the blending of the cuticle. Let me get my nail drill ready. And again, you guys, I apologize if I can't get to every single comment because it is a little bit harder during the snatching of the phalanges. Go ahead and take the golden wand bit. Let's begin the blending of the phalanges. blended that is so beautiful so now we're gonna go in with diamond manny did you guys see the new stickers that we added yesterday to the website the three new ones they are just so beautiful you guys our sticker line has killed the game and i really um really proud of them and also the techniques that we use that we developed for our sticker line are just really really incredible it makes such a huge difference especially in the longevity of the sticker because i think that's why stickers have a bad rap in the industry is because people always associate them with not lasting well or looking very stickery and we really um you know took that head on when we developed the line and we don't want to have those issues I like to take the soft side of the buffer and go around the cuticle area so that way it's nice and flush. Beautiful. And you guys know that I take these nails off right away as soon as we're done filming. That's why I do not mind leaving bubbles, but you know that when we do these on the, on the girls, we make sure there is no bubbles. So I'm gonna take the black abstract one. This one's so dope. And we're going to begin the snatching of the phalange. And I fixed the tweezers that Gloria had ruined as well, too. And then take our silicone tool and press down. Remember when working with our stickers, there are three essential tools. Tweezers, our silicone tool sets, and our pink scissors. Or my pink scissors. I just had them. Well, they're here somewhere, but they're essential.
you guys, this is such a game changer when it comes to nail art, especially for those of us that are nail art handicapped, but still want to be able to either, you know, do nail art or offer it. It really makes such a huge difference. And because the surface of the nail is curved, always press, press, press. And I don't recommend doing this with your finger because your finger has oils and that can cause lifting. Beautiful, look at that, you guys. I'm gonna do one more black one at the top. We're gonna do one more sticker right here at the edge, so that way she finishes off in black. I always like to make the tips of the nail darker. I just think it looks more elegant. And the great thing about our sticker line too is that they're super thin, and you can also layer them. edges, okay? And now we're going to coat the entire nail with one coat of clear press-on gel. And this is going to begin to encapsulate that sticker work and also is like the perfect base for adhering glitters and sequins to the phalange. And what this does is it kind of creates like an encapsulated look to the sticker, making it look plump, but without affecting thickness. That's why we do it really thin, okay?
No squares. No, I forgot. Thank you for inviting me. But it's okay. You can still see him on the other ones. So we're going to take 24 karat glitter. And we're going to add some to the phalange. But we need to add lavender inside. I forgot about that. Uh oh, that's okay. We'll do it later. So we're gonna add some sequins. Some 24K to the phalange. Beautiful. I'm gonna add a little bit more glitter to the tip. Some of the smaller ones. everything I'm gonna bake that for 10 seconds so instead of the larger um, abstract black ones I used BB 77 which is this beautiful super pale lavender just to kind of give it some more dimension for 30 seconds. So chic, right? Does this music remind you guys of Depeche Mode? Let me know in the comments below. this phase where I listen to like older electronic 
maybe a little bit of industrial kind of music. So I'm going to take shiny and we're going to coat the entire phalange in one nice even coat of the shiny gel. You guys already know the number one gel top coat in the universe. Nice even coat over the entire phalange. all that dimension you guys it's stunning we're going to do a little layer of shiny on the inside too to give it that cinderella glass slipper realness because remember these are pre-etched so they have a satin finish to the inside and then you put shiny and she just comes to life and we're going to bake that for one minute I didn't say in the notes. Oh, and it's not um, protected? No? Yeah. What is it? Oh, uh, call her on the phone and tell her that it's... Oh, she's in Germany? And she's sending it to where? Over to another city? Oh, but it's come. I'll just email her and say that um, it came up. Mm -hmm. And that she needs to contact her bank and find out why. And then re uh, reorder. I'm sorry. Yes, definitely. Dance club industrial stuff. My kind of music. She's shaking it already. Oh, you guys, these nails are giving me life. I feel ready to go out with industrial club dance music with the 5XL stiletto. Are you guys living for the 5XL stiletto? Like, it has been such a game changer for the industry. And we really ran with it and just made the best. Legit. Look at that. Oh my gosh. And the beautiful thing about it is it doesn't look like a sticker. It looks like it was hand-painted. So remember, after the hand comes out of the lamp, we're going to wait about 10 seconds, and then we're going to apply our cotton candy cuticle oil. Mm, there we have it. What do you guys think? Do you love it? Put a little product placement in here. Hi everyone. The name of the group is called Moenia. It's M-O-E-N-I-A. They're a Mexican electronic band. They're like the Mexican Depeche Mode, for lack of a better comparison. But the star of the show, you already know, is Miss 5XL Stiletto. Available now. And our new sticker line. Look at that, you guys. This length is everything. Look at the shape from the sides, like you guys. It has no bad angles. Beautiful. Well, my loves, that's going to wrap it up for today's live. 
Yes. Well, my love, that's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this really elegant Versace gold chains with a little lavender design realness. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for choosing enocouture.com and making it the number one nail brand in the universe. Stay safe, stay out.